God has blessed us because who knew growing up in the same church together that we would later on be sharing your last name. All right, I love thought of it a few times, being that I always had a little crush on you. But I observed you grow into an amazing, selfless, confident man. I choose to stand here today in front of you and with you to publicly become your wife in front of your family and loved ones because you have publicly and privately showed me that you are a man of integrity, you are a man of action, you are a man that is humbly surrendered to the Most High, you are a man that doesn't play about your marana. I am here for it. I promise to be the one to lift you up whenever the world seems to turn its back on you. I promise to support your goals, dreams, and ideas no matter how small or big they are. I will adopt those dreams and goals and make them my own so that we, so that we can achieve it together. I promise to respect you and in front of you, behind your back. I'm not only making you my wife because of your beauty, or your pretty brown skin, or your graceful smile, or your long flowing hair. Many other women may have similar physical attributes, but what separates you from the rest is your heart. What elevates you to the title of the most beautiful girl in the world is what you possess on the inside. I vow to not try and change you and turn you into someone you are not. You are you. You are beautiful. I vow not to take for granted your kind-hearted and fun-loving nature. I vow to care for you in the happy moments as well as the stressful moments in the peaceful moments as well as the turbulent moments. I will do all that I can to, to keep that radiant smile on your face. I vow to protect you emotionally, to listen to your concerns and to take emotional burdens off your back so that you can better serve others in need. I vow to cherish you, to give myself up for you in order that you can be the best version of yourself. I vow to love you, to love you like my own body. I promise to be open into exploring new things with you. I am now going to be bone of your bone and flesh of your flesh. I am your rib. I promise to operate in one. There will be no decision I will make without talking to you first and no secrets I will hide from you. And I promise to make it my business that your well-being is priority even on days when it feels like love isn't enough. I promise to seek the Lord daily with you and for you because nothing is ever too big, too small, or impossible for our Lord and Savior who put us together. Thank you for trusting me with your heart. From this day forward, you will not walk alone. My heart, mind, and body is your place of safety and home. Marana, 
Marana. Irving. Irving. I offer you this ring to wear as a symbol of our unbreakable bond and unwavering dedication to you. By the grace of God and by the power of the Holy Spirit, I will cherish you forevermore. I will cherish you forevermore. And as a minister of the gospel of Jesus Christ, I now pronounce you. <laughs> All right. Husband and wife. Irving. <laughs> you can kiss your girl. <laughs>